Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Steve from Rockstar Eater coming to you with another rocket episode. I'm back with another top 10 list and today I'm gonna to be talking about the 10 must try Australian foods. That's right, Australian food. I don't know if you guys know what Australian food is like. Maybe a lot of you guys don't know what it's like and that's why I wanna help you in today's episode. Whether you go to Australia or you walk into a local Australian restaurant, you're gonna open up the menu and you're gonna wonder what to order. What exactly is some really good Australian food? So that's what I'm gonna help you with in today's episode by naming 10 must try Australian foods. Now keep in mind, these aren't the only 10 because there's a lot of Australian foods you can try. But if you stick with these 10, then you're gonna get a good idea of what classical, traditional Australian food is like. So stick all the way to the end of this episode so that you can see this amazing overview of some Australian foods that you can try whether you go to the country or you go into a local restaurant. And also be sure to subscribe to this channel because I release these food videos weekly, some of the best on the internet that you don't wanna miss out on. So go ahead, do that right now, and we're gonna begin the list starting with number one, barramundi. This is the most popular fish in Australia. You can find it just about every Australian restaurant around the country, especially those that serve seafood. And there are a few ways you can eat it, but it's best pan fried or seared skin side first. You won't find this too often battered and deep fried, although fish and chips is a popular food in Australia as well. So if you are a seafood fan and you want a really nice fish dish to try in Australia or in a restaurant, then go with the bear mundi because this really represents Australian fish at its best. Number two, fairy bread. Another one of the great foods in Australia. It's actually more like a snack. These are slices of bread that are cut triangularly, topped with butter, and covered with what's called hundreds and thousands, which are small specks of sprinkles. Thus you get the most colorful toast you'll ever eat. You'll see it especially at many kids' parties, and it's easy to make. In fact, you could probably make it at home as well, but if you insist on eating it in Australia, then hey, it's probably worth the experience. Number three, hamburger with beetroot. Of course we all know hamburgers, it's popular especially in the US. So what makes the Australian version so different? It's really the beetroot that is placed in the burger, along with the local Aussie beef patty. You also got the bun and the cheese of course. So if you're into hamburgers or cheeseburgers, you should definitely try the Australian version. It's really one of the most popular foods that you'll find all over Australia. So don't miss out on this burger fans. Number four, kangaroo. This is the national animal of Australia, as some of you guys might know. So why not eat it as well? Not too many of us are accustomed to eating kangaroo meat, but it's quite a nice thing to have in Australia, and quite common. You can find it in many markets in the country, and in restaurants of course. It tastes great as barbecue, usually on the medium rare side. I wouldn't recommend eating it well done, as it could dry out fast. So if you are an adventurous eater and want to try some kangaroo meat, then Australia is the place to do it. Number five, lamington. Oftentimes referred to as the national cake of Australia. It is a square shaped sponge cake coated in a layer of chocolate and coconut shavings. Sometimes it has jam in the middle as well. You'll find these in many cafes and dessert shops in Australia, and it's really wonderful to have with some coffee and tea. So if you had to pick one cake-like food to eat, then go with the lamington. Great snack, great cake, it's very delicious, it's really one of my favorite Australian foods and snacks. You go for it. Number six, meat pies. Everyone in Australia knows about the meat pies. It's a food that is great for any occasion and you'll find them in many Australian cafes and pastry shops. It's even eaten at sporting events in Australia. It's as it sounds, a thick, flaky, and crispy layer of pie crust and inside is the marinated meat and sauce. It's baked of course and out comes the crispy and savory pie, usually best eaten with tomato sauce spread on top. So if you like meat pies, Try the Australian version. It's so savory, so delicious. Really great Australian comfort food at its best. Number seven, pavlova. People debate whether this dish was invented by New Zealand or Australia, but whatever the case, it's a well-known food in Australia. It's a meringue dessert where the crust is crispy, 
and the inside is soft. It's decorated at times with whipped cream and fruits, especially if it's for special occasions. There are quite a number of desserts you can try in Australia, but if you want to go with something that's pretty big and filling, then pavlova is the way to go. Who knows, maybe if you're in a restaurant, you might actually have this as your birthday cake on your next special occasion. Number eight, sausage rolls. If you try the meat pies, then you also gotta try the sausage rolls. It's made in a similar fashion in that instead of the meat filling, you have the sausage filling underneath the pastry. It's crispy on top and so savory because of the sausage meat inside. It's great as a lunch item. Maybe you've tried sausages before, but you've never had them in pastry form. Then why not start here with Australian cuisine, sausage roll, another one of the great comfort foods of Australia. Number nine, barbecue snags. This is another term for sausages. It's especially popular as barbecue, which is worth mentioning. Australian barbecue is known for its many choices of meats, and one of them you should try is the sausage. It's thin and long, made of beef or pork, and marinated with spices from all around the world. And it is oftentimes eaten in a roll or bread with your favorite sauce, kind of like an American hot dog. So try some snacks today, especially if you are a sausage fan. And finally, number 10, Vegemite on toast. Another one of the great foods of Australia. It's this thick, dark, brown paste that can be enjoyed for many occasions like breakfast, lunch, or tea time. You take the spread and put it on top of the toast. Spread it around nicely and you have what's equivalent to American peanut butter toast, but of course with a much different taste. This is as Australian as it gets. So if you like toast and you want to try an awesome snack that is well known all around Australia, then Vegemite on toast is something that you definitely need to try. Well, there you go with the 10 must try Australian foods, whether you go to Australia or you walk into a local restaurant that serves Australian food. There's a lot more out there in Australia. And if you guys want to comment below and mention some of the other great ones, some of the ones that you think I should have mentioned in this episode, then please do comment. Well, thank you so much for watching this episode, guys. Give me a like if you like what I'm doing here or you found this video to be very helpful. And also, like I said, please subscribe to this video as well so that you can get awesome food videos weekly, such as this one right here. So I hope you have a great time, whether you go to Australia or you walk into your local restaurant, enjoy that Australian food. And be sure to check out also the other videos on my screen so that you can see some of the other food videos that I've done that can be helpful to you as well. So I'll see you guys in the next video.